Yeah. Yeah, I uh, I know um, people that have s- watched me on YouTube and via videos on the internet of me. Um, over a hundred, by the way. Yeah. But before I became this mega, super duper rock on sex goddess that's standing in front of you, um, I performed in wherever I could perform, you know? Um, for instance, uh, I performed at a gentleman's club quite a few times. And when you perform in a gentleman's club, um, <laughs> it, it's crazy, you never believe it, but, like, weird shit happens. <laughs> weird, you see weird shit, you know? Um, like, uh, in sake of this episode, this story, this, uh, short amount of time I have with you guys, um, you find, like, the normal protocol, I guess, you know, it's not my cup of tea, like, if I wasn't telling jokes there, I wouldn't be there, it's just not my, it's just not my element, um, it's, uh, yeah, um, not that I have no, like, stance either way, I guess. I try to see both lines of it, but in terms of just my personal preference, um, I just don't want to pay to view the menu, if you know what I mean. So, uh, but anyway, but speaking of the paying part of it, you know, the typical thing is uh, gentlemen get their money and they pay for women to take their clothes off and do a little dance for them, right? But, uh, one, uh, one day I was, uh, doing my stand-up gig, and, uh, I noticed there was these gentlemen from India. And, yes, they're from India, because I asked them. Because, (laughs) this is brilliant. This is so brilliant. Um, so this guy, the thing was, why I knew they were from India, and I asked, like, the other guys he was with was, he was a co-worker of mine. It's like, and you could tell he's kind of had backish for me. And I was like, hey, what's going on? Like, I got him back, um, and uh, he's like, play along. Play along. You see me. You get on your knees. And I'm like, okay. And he's like, don't call me, you know, Shoresh. Call me Prince Shoresh. I'm like, Okay, Prince Suresh, kind of like it, ninth is a little gig. And you gotta understand, you know, if you uh, seen the movie, uh, oh, that Eddie Murphy movie, yeah? Yeah, where, where he's like a prince. Yeah, yeah. So, so I was like, okay, you know, I'll play along. You know, I just, I, I never want to be the cock blocker, right? You never want to be that guy, purposely. Now, if a guy's a douchebag, then hey, give me a gold medal. But really, like, this is legit dude, you know, hey man, I don't wanna. It's like, I'll play along. It's kind of a smart idea. So he's like with, and he had people, other people from work that I didn't really know, but I knew they were from work, pretending to be like they're white and one black guy. So the one black guy, he's like six foot four, six foot three, six foot four. He's a bodyguard. <laughs> hey, hey, I'm not making this, you know, this is their, you know, thing, very smart. And then the white guy was PR and another white guy was the driver. They had it all figured out. Now, so his gimmick was he was a prince and he had all of his security embassy and stuff, all right? So you're like thinking, all right, so what's the big deal? Well, his whole prince gimmick he had, since he was from India, he didn't um, give currency. His currency was different. And it wasn't like he gave, um, like, Indian money or jewels or something. You know, it would make sense if he gave jewels and stuff. But what they did was, there was a Walmart across the street. So, so, uh... They went in the Walmart, the Walmart, Walmart, 
and uh, got baby clothes. Yeah, bought a bunch of baby clothes, maybe like $20 worth of baby clothes. Which you're like, huh? But $20 of baby clothes worth of, yeah, you know, $20 worth of baby clothes at a Walmart? Shit, man. That could dress up, I don't know, like at least a good 10 babies, you know? Yeah. So he did that, and he was like tipping the, and these ladies were fighting to strip for him, because he would like be like, oh, you want the baby shoes? You gotta really show me your titties, you know? It's like, man, yeah, I told ya. I know, I'm probably not that crazy, but pretty, pretty interesting. Didn't expect for to hear that story.